Good morning, Alatuna. I'm O'Hara Demetko. And I'm Meredith Kennedy. And today is Tuesday, May 18th, and it's I Love Reese's Day. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I, I pledge, pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for a moment of silence. The student of the day for Wednesday, May 18th is Balin Ball. Balin has been a delight to teach this semester. She welcomes her teachers daily with a smile that brightens up the room. Balin is one of the hardest working students in class. She is concerned for her success and does not settle for less than her best. She has a positive attitude that is infectious and encourages and challenges her peers, whether she is working in the classroom or studying for a unit test. Her teachers are very proud of this young lady and look forward to her bright future. Current and former art students, please come and pick up your artworks from Ms. Mack. Many pieces still remain here from last semester's art show. Again, current and former students, please pick up last semester's artwork as ASAP as possible. Students, it's time to get those library books turned in before summer. If you bring back your books before May 20th, you will be rewarded with a sweet treat. Any boys interested in basketball next year can come by Coach Hood's office and pick up a summer basketball schedule. We will get started soon, so make sure you pick up a schedule. The deadline to order, your, to order your certificate of enrollment is Friday. The certificate will be good for the entire summer. Calling all Latin students, don't miss our bowling night at Stars and Strikes this Friday at 5 o'clock. Each person will need to bring $25, which will cover bowling, laser tag, food, and drinks. Your books are coming out this Friday, and we are all super excited about this year's mystery theme. And here is some information from our yearbook staff. Hi, I am Ann Madeline Wilson, and I'm one of the editors on the yearbook staff this year. Um, hi, I'm Devin. I'm on the yearbook staff also. Okay, so for this year, oh gosh, where do we even begin to describe this book? We really wanted to capture a lot of memories from this year, especially with winning two state championships, with all the sports, the, all the success the sports have had, um, and especially all the academics that people participate in. We really wanted to build on the foundation of the school and tell where everyone came from or started freshman year or, and like have built on that. We brought in all coverage devices which are known as ACDs to incorporate everyone in the book this year because in past years um, not everyone has been involved in it so we really tried to do that this year. And it took a lot more work but I think it was more worth it because just the same people have been in the book every year and we just wanted everyone to be in it. And this yearbook staff is definitely one of a kind. Um, we all got along but we all brought something different to the team and it was really cool because like everyone played a different sport and everyone had different connections to and we all thought of different themes. We probably went through six themes before we stuck on this one but I think it was worth it. So we just wanted to bring something different to the table this year, so we really hope you like it. Hi, I'm Glenn. And I'm Olivia. And there will be 20 t-shirts being given out, five per grade. Five will be hidden around the school. When a student finds one, please come to Miss Darby Williams' room 2202 to tell where you found it so we can mark it off. Five will be hidden in five different teachers' rooms. One will be in Rex Kwan Doe's lair, one will be in the room where you see the cow. One will be in Jenny from the Block's room. One will be in Boo Bear's room. And one will be in Boo Bear's Love's room. To claim the t-shirt, the student must text the answer to the Yearbook Remind 101. The first ones to text Miss Williams and she reply will receive the t-shirt. You have to text at yearbucks, Y-E-A-R-B-U-C-S, to 81010. Five will be given to the first five kids who text Miss Williams through Remind 101 who have a birthday in August. Five will be given to the first five kids who text Miss Williams through Remind 101 who can answer this riddle. I am the beginning of the end, 
and the end of time and space. I am essential to the creation and I surround every place. What am I? Teachers, if you know the answer, please do not tell your students. Golden tickets. There will be golden tickets hidden in some yearbooks when given out on Friday, May 20th. If a student receives a ticket in his or her yearbook, please allow them to come to the yearbook room to claim their prize. Room 2202. Thanks. <laughs> And congratulations to our boys lacrosse team for winning the state championship this past Saturday against Westminster with a final score of 9-7. Way to go, guys. It's been a great year to be a Buck. So each year here at ABBC, we have a tradition of honoring our hardworking senior crew. And we typically like to do it live, but we never know when we're going on anymore. So we tried to make this about 15 minutes ago. Oh, it looks good. Here we are. All right, so special thanks to our director, Carl, our audio director, Jenna, our technical director, Kravka, our floor director, Lane, and our jack-of-all-trades, McLean. We hope these accurate 2D action figures show how much we kind of care. So thanks, I guess. That's all for the morning announcements for this year. I hope your summer is smooth sailing, Alatuna, and we'll see you next year. I'm so sad.